Now I'm going to push the box forward a little bit so I can fit the amp slash battery rack back here. Well, there you have it, YouTube. She's in there. One thing left to do is mount it up, well, secure it in here, and then wire it up. Stay what I'm about to do is install the batteries in the battery rack, and hopefully wire them up today as well. So without further ado, let's get this started. So, got the batteries in there, so I guess I'm about to wire them up right now. We'll wire the amps up. So, let me go grab some um, Sky High 12 gauge wire for I'm um, use that for the um, remote wire. So, all right, couldn't find my 8 gauge, I mean, correction, my 12 gauge Sky High remote wire. So, I just got some of this black wire that I had left over from my old install. So, you know, I'm going to have to order some more of this 12 gauge and remote wire from Sky High. But in the meantime, just use that until that wire get here. And so without further ado, let's, hit, let's hook this bad boy up. She's so pretty.
What's up about that YouTube ain't you know the camera field? One thing you know about me, my installs gotta be clean. I don't like the sloppy shit. I know it ain't the professional, done by a professional, but I make it do what it do, baby. And of course, after this, make sure the wires are cleaned up, tucked away, zip tied. But I'm just running it right now to get the length. All right, now we got all the remote wires ran. Now it's time to hook up the batteries to the amplifiers. With well, amplifiers to the batteries. So let's knock that piece out. Don't worry about this wire. I'm gonna end up securing it to the wood like this along the front side of it. So yeah, that's just temporary for right now. Well, YouTube, my camera died, so that's why y'all didn't get to see the rest of the video. Wow, the progress I was doing, all the progress that I did. As you can see, I've been very busy. Uh, got the wires hooked up, amps wired in. Only thing left is the speaker wire and um, the RCA is hooked up. But I gotta, and plus to clean that up, the remote wire. But other than that, Everything turned out all right. Oh yeah, and replace that sky high with welding cable that's running to the front and add more runs of welding cable from the front to the back. But that's for a later date. Right now I feel accomplished. Got most of the stuff done. So without further ado, let's see if it powers up. I haven't tested that yet out. So hopefully nothing blows up. So let's see if we get power. And like that, we get power. So, thank you too for watching. Thank for everybody for supporting the channel. If you want to see more modifications, please subscribe. If you like this video, like it. And uh, your boy's out.